the Air Jordan 13 is now coming back with the 2023 version in the playoff colorway. In today's video, guys, we are going to be discussing everything you need to know about the sneaker in this review, along with how to cop it and where to cop it. Before we hop into the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Anthony Matilla, and I post every single day on this YouTube channel, bringing you guys the latest, the greatest, and the earliest heat. Starting off with the boxes, secret, you got your classic gray Jordan 13 box with the circle and the red Jumpman in the center of it. This is a size 11.5 men's, and the retail on this secret was $210 and is releasing to the public February 18th. And I was able to pick up this pair early through Nike sneakers last week on the Shock Drop exclusive access. I had to move quick. There wasn't that many people that copped. I was able to pick up the size, which is more of a kind of like rare size, 11.5, or at least kind of just harder to get rather than your smaller sizes. Getting onto the secret, guys, let me know in the comments, is this a cop or a drop? I know a lot of people are going crazy about the secret right here. And this is a really put together sneaker from the quality to the materials and just the history behind the sneaker really make it awesome. Starting off with the outer soles of the sneaker, one of my favorite parts. I love the carbon fiber on the outer soles. Got this nice carbon fiber look on the side panels and then these two small panels right here. Got your Jumpman right here in this nice green pop color. Nice traction on the outer soles. Got nice white little riddles right here with some gray touches and red outlines that really just kind of make the shoe, the bottom of the shoe just pop from afar. When you're looking at the shoe from afar, you see the nice leather on the sneaker with the little hole prints inside it. The quality of this leather is really, really good compared to a lot of other shoes we've seen more recently. I feel like Jordan 13 quality, especially the playoffs from the originals, the quality was A1. Starting off with the back of the sneaker, you got this nice leather feeding around to the tops and on both sides, both the inside and the outside. And even the front panels on the toe box got this nice butter, kind of just smooth leather feel. Super comfortable on your toes when you're rocking it. You got a little Jordan touch right here in this nice yellow and black stitch in. Nice little touch right there. Feed it onto the top of the sneaker on this nice tongue where you have the synthetic suede feel. Super cool. You don't see a lot of like synthetic suede or just kind of like this specific feeling on any other shoe. The shoe comes laced up in these nice black rope laces. No additional laces for the sneaker. I think the black kind of just feel from the sneaker. It looks super sharp and just overall, you can put a lot of outfits together. And this sneaker does fit true to size, so pick up the normal size you wear when you're purchasing this sneaker. You should be able to pick up the sneaker for retail come February 18th. This shoe is releasing super high stock just everywhere, both in-store and online retailers. At 10 a.m. on Nike sneakers, February 18th, they will be releasing this sneaker right here. The largest stock across this release right here is on Nike sneakers, and you're probably your best chances will be on that app. Of course, along with your in-store retailers, make sure I really encourage you guys to check out your local stores, your Foot Locker, your FLX, especially your FLX kind of like app raffles. Download the app, enter the raffle for three, usually like three stores or near you guys that have the shoe. You enter it, put your like your head starts to increase your chances of securing that size. I have found huge success in FLX and the Foot Locker system super efficient and reliable additionally to those websites and app raffles you'll have your dtlrs your snipes and your other retailers for in-store raffles usually you go to those type of stores or they have it on their app i know snipes is kind of between the app and in-store dtlrs are usually in store so make sure you check out your stores prior to the release about a week before and just days leading up check out the raffles and make sure you get in before the release since this is a GR, a general release sneaker, your chances of copying this shoe are pretty high as long as you put in the work, enter those raffles, and you should be able to pick up your size for retail. Getting back onto the sneaker and everything, guys, when you don't see this nice leather on top, you have the synthetic underneath, synthetic suede underneath, wrapped around to the back, where you have the nice 23 right here. And then also on the other sneaker, you have the other 23 super clean guys of course that little touch for the jordan 13s really kind of just bring the shoe together more onto the midsole of the sneaker got your nice white touches right here with the little humps the red outline from the bottoms and the nice black also right here jordan 13s are pretty comfortable guys you can hoop in them you can wear them just about wherever you want to go they're going to hold up super good quality on the sneaker just like the old og releases Moving on top to the tongue of the sneaker, you got this nice 
circle in this nice yellow color with the Jumpman in that nice red color for that additional pop matching the Jordan right here. The subtle colors and the touches really kind of just tie the sneaker in together. And then more of that synthetic suede on the top of the tongue and then the inside of the tongue, you got just nice cushion and your size tag right there with all your information. You got nice black insole, hard to see through camera, but the red Jumpman is in the center of it. Super clean guys, nice cushion, super soft at touch around the ankle and you can even see it right here, wrap around to the back. And just overall the quality is just kind of like premium I'd say on the sneaker as long as Jordan 13s go in the playoff colorway. And that concludes it for today's video, guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for tuning into the video. And I'm hoping you guys all are able to get that W February 18th on the playoff Jordan 13 Retro 2023. See you guys tomorrow with more heat. Peace.